much. Raphael Sinamo and Giuseppe Zanotti shoes and a Jenny Packham necklace. Thank you so much. Thank you. I mean, it's the GQ Men of the Year Awards, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, nothing to complain about. Lots of great looking men and actors that I really respect and I'm excited to just be in the presence of. It's a great Hollywood event. My goodness, um, that's a great question. It's going to sound really, really cheesy, but my stepfather. <laughs> my stepfather is an amazing man, um, in my life anyway. He would have to go to the top of my list. Um, as far as the men who are here tonight, I'll let the public decide that one. <laughs> now, we are not, we're honoring Clint Eastwood as badass of the year. That's a great choice. I saw Gran Torino, and he is definitely the badass of the year. <laughs> the movie was amazing. It was the... The whole movie, the whole movie, it was amazing. And his voice, it's that voice, he really just commands an audience. Now your old castmate, Drake. I know, Drake, people call him Drake and I'm like, sorry, who? Aubrey Graham, yes. He's also being honored tonight for Gangster Killers, for killing gangster rap music. How does it feel to sort of see him come? That's amazing, oh my god, I'm so proud of him. Oh, I'm like red, that's amazing. I, I grew up across the street from Aubrey, so he's, you know, a very, uh, close friend of mine holds a really close place in my heart so I'm so proud he's come so far it all happened like overnight he's been working so hard at it for so long and for a kid from Canada to make it this huge it's like unbelievable he's writing with the best of them so my love goes out to you Ovs